In the presence of the commander of the National Guard, Lieutenant General His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa, and the Deputy Chairman of the Supreme Council of Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and the President of the Royal Equestrian and Horse Racing Federation, Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa, the 12th horse race of the season was held this afternoon in Rafa Sakhir. Also present was the Minister of Youth and Sports Affairs, Mr. Hisham Al Jodar. The eighth race event was held for the Cups of the Ministry of Youth and Sports Affairs. At the end of the race, trophies were distributed to the winners.
Bahrain is witnessing an unprecedented increase in tourism activity attributed to the security and stability the kingdom enjoys, coupled with its modern tourism infrastructure, state-of-the-art malls and tourism facilities, as well as the wide range of culture and entertainment activities. Bahrainis, residents, tourists, and the record number of visitors from Gulf Arab states who arrived in Bahrain this week through the King Fahd Causeway have created a business boom as restaurants, shopping malls, and hotels were packed with guests. Bahrain continues to be an important tourist destination in the region, thanks in large to the heavy new investments in tourism infrastructure. Bahrain, the Pearl of the Gulf, is considered a unique culture and tourism destination in the GCC and is well known for its tolerant lifestyle and rich history and traditions. Bahrain's success in attract attracting such a high number of visitors demonstrates the, how the world views Bahrain and how Bahrain remains an oasis of peace, security and stability. One of the most hotly anticipated events on Bahrain's annual calendar of tourism attractions, Shop Bahrain, officially opened last night at its epicenter festival city in Bahrain Bay. More details on this report with Daniela Do Porto. The third annual National Shopping Festival, Shop Bahrain, opened last night at Festival City in Bahrain Bay, where there will be carnival attractions, live performances and food and retail stores for the duration of the 30-day event, in addition to the offerings at participating retail outlets and restaurants across the island. The festival aims to boost the retail and tourism sectors and was managed by the Bahrain Tourism and Exhibitions Authority and Tamkeen, with a variety of public and private sector partners, including malls, hotels and prize sponsors. I'm very glad to see uh, the Festival City live in Bahrain with um, uh, many um, uh, visitors from our neighboring countries. Uh, I think uh, the timing uh, of the GCC um, holidays and the festival uh, is, is quite accurate and uh, it's something to do with the shopping festival. Other than the main activities in the malls and the retail discounts, there's more entertainment in Bahrain. What we're focusing on is building the Bahraini calendar whereby each month there is a main event that coincides with a certain seasons. So for instance, um, now there's the, uh, the, the Saudi and Kuwaitis and Qataris holiday, including the Bahraini holidays as well. So it would be a definitely a GCC uh, visitor uh, consumer. Yet um, in the future, depending on the seasons, we attract different uh, target markets. We're going to go for shopping. We need more than that. Let's go for shopping. Shop Bahrain is a nationwide event comprising special shopping experiences and sales, a variety of entertainment options, culinary taste tours and raffle draws for over 25,000 prizes. It was designed to delight local families as well as attract visitors from neighbouring countries. The organisers are targeting a 30% increase in the average spend per tourist to 100 dinars. Most of the indicators we've been seeing is through social media. As you know, social media these days is a big indicator for us. And uh, it's been really well. You, you see a lot of people um, tagging their friends and family members and saying we got to be here. So, so we're happy about that and, and we're waiting for them. Shop Bahrain aims to be about much more than shopping, with something to offer visitors of all ages. I love the games that's here and I love the... That what they put about scientific things. I love the, the games that are in this place. And, and uh, I play here and there. I was brought here by my wife. She told me about it, so I followed. I just drove here because she couldn't find the place, but it was quite easy to get to. It really was. There's tons of parking, and I had to come. There is a double-decker carousel ride here. There's mini golf, there's a bouncy castle, there's games. I have not been to a carnival since university days abroad, so to be here, this is going to be so much fun. And you can tell popcorn. how excited she is. I don't I'm really need excited. <laughs> Shop Bahrain 2017 has officially begun with 30 days and nights of special retail offerings, live entertainment and fun for all the family. Reporting from Festival City for Bahrain International, I'm Danielle Deporto.